celebrating Omani Women's Day on Merge with Rumetha. As we're leading into Omani Women's Day, I had the pleasure to speak with five phenomenal women who represent the diversity of the stories we hear every day. From a mother who fought her way to go back to school after 27 years, to professionals in male-dominated positions, to a frontliner who contracted COVID and came out stronger. This is their stories. Nawad al is a field engineer working for Oman's premier oil and gas company, Petroleum Development of Oman. She is considered one of the first females to move to work in the field, something that was not done before. I asked her, as an Armani woman working in a male-dominated industry, how was she able to maneuver through this? First of all, what you should understand is that going to the field was a choice that I made. I was given an opportunity which I took because I knew exactly what I wanted and how beneficial this would be for my career. So I was willing to go above and beyond to make it successful. This was not the first time where I was finding myself in such situation. During my last years in college, I was the only female in my class. I was prepared for what I was going to face. You will meet people who will have different opinion, people who will wait to celebrate on your failure, and some people who will be very supportive. All I had to do was to stay focused on my objective and ignore all the negativity that was thrown in my direction. Lucky enough for me, uh, being an Omani woman, I was privileged enough to get the support I needed from the management in PDO. Today I am a production supervisor, leading a group of male operators. That's bring a lot of controversy around me, but at the end of the day, I know exactly what I want and I am willing to do what it takes to make it successful. Noir fought tooth and nail to ensure that she got the same opportunities as the men engineers in the field. I was wondering what challenges she faced once women were finally allowed to work like men in the oil fields. It was not an easy journey and uh, we faced a lot of challenges. Some of them which were directly uh, linked to our work and some of them had an impact in our day-to-day life. And we still face challenges as we move forward in our career. For many years, field positions were occupied by men only. So the idea of bringing women in the field brought up controversy. To change that perception, we had to make people understand that we are engineers first. Just as uh, male engineers, we had the right to get the same exposure and the same opportunities in order to be successful uh, in, in the future. We have to work hard and double our effort in order to be noticed especially when we are competing with men. It requires a lot of sacrifices and we had to be present and um, dare to do a lot of different things in order to prove that we deserve this job and we can do it and make it successful. Another thing that uh, we face when we got there is being accepted because when you work in the field it becomes like a second home for you because you are spending weeks away from your family. So we had to earn people trust and establish a workplace culture where we could all be comfortable working with each other. We talked about her perspective in regards to the future of women engineers in Oman. We've seen an increased number of uh, female engineers graduating uh, over the past years, talented women uh, and um, unique in their identity who have excelled in their studies. Therefore, it gives me uh, confidence to say that we will be seeing uh, women taking on uh, leadership roles in engineering as well as uh, being innovative. At the end of our talk, I asked her if she had any last words of wisdom she wanted to share to the aspiring engineers of the future. My advice to everyone listening to me is that never let fear hold you back. Believe in yourself and uh, stay focused on your goals. 
We are fortunate enough to be in Oman where women are given equal opportunities to work in different fields. So it's our duty to encourage and support each other to take more initiative and work hands in hands with our male colleagues to realize our aspiration as well as inspiring the next generation. Omani Women's Day with Rumaitha on Merge. Brought to you by BMW. Season of Style. Take October by storm with exciting offers on your new BMW.